This is the pitch for the rough boards. Um, we start with uh, one shot of Rachel just walking forward through the woods, tracking shot, front facing. Pretty standard, camera's a little bit low. Um, we cut to an establishing shot, we see the clearing that the fight's going to happen in and establish the layout. Um, cut to a close up, we see Rachel looking around and then her eyes locking on the robot. Um, we cut to a POV and we see something off in the distance that's glowing but it's faded into the darkness and uh, Rachel is like, <coughs> sorry, squints to get a better look. Um, and then we cut to a close up using a long lens. So the perspective is gonna be uh, with less depth to kind of mimic the like idea of a telescope or like a zoom lens. Um, and we see the robot starting to light up and we hear its its energy ball starting to charge up um i also think it could be cool if you added some noise into the image just so that you can get the the vibe of like nighttime like grainy darkness um then we get a reaction shot of rachel who suddenly realizes that she's about to be attacked um and we get this dutch angle just like a medium shot of the robot firing off his attack. I don't really know how it would look for him to shoot an energy ball, so it's up to you to animate. Um, but the camera dollies back to follow the energy ball really, really, really fast, so um, everything else is going to be blurred, motion blurred. And uh, it follows all the way back to Rachel, who just barely dive rolls out of the way like just in time um and then we cut to front facing close of her dive roll it gets a little bit rougher at this point because uh, i didn't have all the time but um we get the get the roll and she does this move where as she <coughs> sorry <coughs> as she comes out of the roll and gets back up on her feet her hands come together and uh activate her gloves and she just springs forward um as she springs forward she goes into a sprint i also don't know how this, I don't know how you would want Rachel to run, but I have her just in a normal sprint. Um, and we get the tracking, uh, the trailing red light. Um, then we cut to the robot who kind of does this like mechanical, like almost animal, like tilt of his head just to like, like he's assessing what's going on. And then he winds up and shoots forward just like inhuman speed um with inhuman speed and then uh we get another shot of him running and then we get we cut to wide of them both running in them converging and then we cut to wide with a top down that's spinning and zooming um of them both converging uh cut to close we see the glove on her hand that's glowing with magic energy as she runs. As she uh, flicks her hand open, it starts surrounding her hand in glowy red energy. And then she quickly clenches her fist, which activates her attack. Um, then, <coughs> We get a shot of her winding up the punch and letting it loose into the robot and the camera is going to stay close and track the motion on this one um, and follow through to the other side and see the energy go through the other side 
um, and then we'll cut to wide and we'll see the effects of the punch of the robot going flying. Um, there will also be the um, text behind him that he will cover up as he flies back. Um, and as he covers it up, it will disappear. Um, after he flies back, we get this cowboy shot of uh, Rachel. We see her glove. Maybe it's starting to power down as she thinks she's kind of won the battle. And we see the dead, well, presumably dead robot here. And we get a reaction shot of Rachel as she's kind of starts to calm down. Um, then we get a close up and we see like the condition that the robot's in. And <coughs> as far as we can tell, he looks dead. And we get another reaction shot as Rachel starts to react to something like with confusion or like she's focused or something. Um, cut back to the robot as its head eerily um, and like robotically turns um, to reveal that it's not dead and then its arm starts to get pulled up like by its servos um, kind of looking like a puppet like you were saying and the camera tracks up slowly as it rises to its feet in just a very like mechanical way um, and then its arm extends out to a blade um, with the motion of its arm flying out the camera tracks up just as fast um, just to emphasize the energy we get this down shot of Rachel so this shot was an upshot of the robot, and this shot is a downshot of Rachel as she reacts with surprise and fear. Um, I'm not super sold on this particular shot, but I'm cutting back to the cowboy shot of the glove because the robot's going to attack, and then we're going to focus in on Rachel's counterattack, and that's She's going to do that with her glove. So it gets really rough at this point. I don't, you can barely tell what's going on. Um, but this is the sword um, that is swinging down as Rachel is dodging out of the way. Um, <coughs> and right after this sword hits, maybe the, hits the ground or just misses, then we see Rachel kind of spring into action and activate her glove which will create a sword. Uh, in the script you have that their fight goes on for a while. I have a few ideas um, and I will I will board that part as soon as I can. Um, but as far as as far as it goes this, this is how far I got. Um, I want to board the final scenes and then go back and board the fight in the middle. And I should be able to get the final scenes done, or at least done roughly by the end of this week. And then um, I might go back, depending on your notes, and refine these boards more, just because these are really rough at some points. Um, I wish I could have gotten the whole thing done from start to finish, but I just didn't have time, um, and I figured I would get this to you now so that you can start animating these these shots, which will probably take you a while, and while you work on that, I can board the rest of it, um, just so like I'm not crunching and I can actually take the time to make it as good as I can. Um, So, let me know if you have any questions. Um, and let me know if you want me to change anything or refine anything particularly. Um, <coughs> and 
and I will send you I will send you this these JPEGs and then once I get the f rest of the board roughed out I'll cut it together as an animatic and send you that as well so yeah thank you